Once again this weekend, we're offering suggestions for filling up all those long hours at home. To start us off, Daniel Feinberg, TV critic for The Hollywood Reporter. With movie theaters and public performance venues shut down and countless workers in quarantine, much of the population is eyeing a future spent disproportionately glued to our couches looking for good things to watch on television. In short, we're becoming a nation of TV critics. As somebody who was on this bandwagon professionally long before various public officials made it mandatory, allow me to offer some advice. First off, even if actual Hollywood production has ground to a halt, the crisis hit us just as some of TV's best shows were launching new seasons. Hi! Don't come over here, don't come over here. Don't. Pamela Adlon's FX comedy Better Things is compassionate, funny, and uncomfortably realistic. AMC's Better Call Saul may not be better than Breaking Bad, but it's far closer than anybody could have imagined. And if you like twisty, somewhat confusing mythology, mixed with lots of robots, HBO's Westworld is overstuffed. So complicated. So that's a lot to watch right there. This is also the perfect moment for rainy day shows, those ambitious or long-running TV series that you've been putting off until you could give them the concentration they deserve. Mine include Netflix's Peaky Blinders and Fauda, but if you haven't watched all-time classics like The Wire or The Leftovers or Rectify, no more excuses. Seeking something funny and emotional? Surprise. Try Freeform's unusual family comedy, Everything's Gonna Be Okay. Yeah, I'm cool. Your torso's too long. And this may be the perfect moment for Parks and Recreation, the most hopeful show ever made about government hey. dysfunction. Am I interrupting something important? Impossible. I work for the government. Missing Travel? HBO's My Brilliant Friend, adapted from Elena Ferranti's novels, is like a passport to an Italy from a different era. Rami. Or check out Hulu's underrated comedy Rami, which wrapped its first season with two great episodes filmed in Egypt. And if you're exhausted by your family, Security! catch up on HBO's Succession, a reminder that no matter how crazy your relatives are making you, it could always be much, much worse. You back off! This is an executive level business! All told, that's hours and hours of television that should offer you something we all could use right now. Distraction from the outside world.